When Venezuela moved into the second round here in Miami, they knew they would be in friendly territory. This city's vibrant and vocal Latin American community really knows how to bring the music and the atmosphere. And the huge Venezuelan community in South Florida is seizing this opportunity to see and cheer for their baseball heroes. The most famous one in Florida is Miguel Cabrera. Nowadays is Cabrera, Ordonez. You know, it's a lot of good, good players coming out. Baseball is a major sport in Minnesota. We love baseball. And fans over there, and fans over here, we're everywhere. The Venezuelan players and coaches are clearly loose and relaxed after winning their group in round one by beating the USA. They opened with a victory here over the Netherlands in round two, and they appear to have some swagger as they continue through the second round looking for a berth in the semifinals in Los Angeles on the weekend. Yeah, overall, I think we play good and uh, we're pretty confident in the second round, and we're just going to try to do whatever we did in the, second, in the first round. Just, you know, play as a team and do the little things. This Venezuelan team is quite a gathering of baseball talent. More than 15 players on the roster are major league players, many of them superstars like Andy Chavez, and representing a country that loves its baseball and follows very closely the fortunes of these players and how they do in the major leagues. And that country certainly will have high expectations of these highly paid players now that they've pulled on the Venezuelan national uniform. You feel some pressure? High expectations. They expect you to win. Yeah, I mean, uh, not pressure, but we know it's a big responsibility. Uh, got this name in the jersey. So we, we, we beat hard and trying to do you know, everything we can to support our country and pull our name on you know, the top. Andres Galarraga knows a thing or two about this game. He played 19 Major League seasons and clubbed 399 home runs in his day. As he keeps an eye on the Venezuelan hitters and their technique. He likes the way his team is looking. The unit those people have right now is, is, is amazing, it's unbelievable. The way they train it, the way they play, extra hitting, extra workout. I mean, they, they, they do it for the team, also for get ready for the season. But I mean, they, they, the unit they have is unbelievable. So nobody's a superstar once they pull on the Venezuela top, right? Everybody's That's true. The same, yeah. That's true. Everybody's the same. No superstar. Everybody wants to win. Galarraga and his Venezuelan hitters have the potential to run up big scores in a hurry as they love to swing for the fences. But they ran into some clever pitchers at times against the Dutch and only won by a score of 3 to 1. So the feeling is if the party's to continue beyond Miami and on to Los Angeles, the Venezuelans will need pitching defense and base running to be excellent as well. Brendan Connor, Al Jazeera, Miami.